Hi, it's Dr. Centeno. And what if you get tachycardia or rapid heart rate when you turn your head? And it happens pretty reliably when you turn your head or move your head in a certain direction, looking down, looking up, et cetera. And what if you have actually had that worked up by cardiology and they don't know what's going on? Well, one of the things to consider is that in the craniocervical instability patients I treat, we see patients who get irritation of the vagus nerve, usually at C1, and the vagus nerve acts as the brakes on the heart. So if you take away the brakes, the heart rate can go up. These same patients also have usually POTS or postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome and have rapid heart rate when they get up and down. Sometimes they don't have POTS, they just have rapid heart rate when they move their head. So if that's happening to you and it's been worked up and no one knows what's happening, you might consider craniocervical instability as a diagnosis. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Hey, get this out to more patients by like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks so much.